What's up guys, welcome to today's video. It's gonna be a very quick video because it is only a 782 square foot condo here, but you guys saw this a couple weeks ago when we first bought this. We are about 80% done, I would say, with the renovation. So I'm gonna flip the camera around and give you guys a quick tour before I have to head off to LA. Everything that's been done so far, we have our flooring done, which was $800 plus $1,000 in materials. So we are about $1,800 for the floors, $162 for the material on the baseboards, which I do think they actually gave my guys the wrong size baseboard. I ordered two different baseboards for two different properties on two different invoices, and I believe they gave them the wrong invoice, unfortunately. So these are like the six inch baseboards which are cool, they're more expensive, but for this small of a home, it's just like not needed, but it is what it is. I'm gonna have to talk with the uh, place that I bought it at to make sure that um, the other house that they're gonna do has the same baseboards as well, and hopefully they'll eat up that cost. But we got paint going today and tomorrow. We have cabinet paint going in. We're gonna get new hinges, new handles. We did get granite done with a new sink over here, a new bowl. We are gonna do backsplash, so I'm not super worried about that. I came out here today to actually measure the backsplash so my guy can go do it. We're about $8,000 in, so we're probably gonna be right at $12,000, which is on the high end of our budget, but it is what it is. It needed a little bit more work than what we thought. We're not too far over. We're literally probably about 500 to a grand over. Bathroom looks really, really crispy. I'm happy how this came out. This was $1,800 with demo, valve switches, um, getting all the new um, trim in there. We did a dollar <laughs> 59 or dollar 69 a square foot for this tile which is really really nice tile i am a huge fan of how this came out for the price of it for under a dollar 70 a square foot this tile came out really really nice for this under for this under two hundred thousand dollar home this is like the perfect setup i think this will be a good selling point uh we're going to texture these walls right here get new light fixtures get a new mirror so they're going to trash that we are going to leave the vanity just because of the price point of the home it's not expected to have anything super nice in there we are going to get a new toilet all the new outlets will be changed too so this is where it's going to start getting like towards the end of our budget it's just going to go really pricey because this is going to be a couple hundred dollars to replace all this with my handyman coming out here for the labor we got we already ordered all the um, material and stuff so we got the chandelier we got the fans we got the lights already in that eight eight thousand dollar budget so hopefully we can stay on top of everything the flooring came out pretty good we have this flooring on our other house as well. I think it'll come together even more once we paint the cabinets and get a fresh coat of paint on the walls because this is like one of the ugliest and worst paint jobs that I've ever seen. I think it was done by the previous tenant on their own. Like they didn't tape off anything, so it just looks horrible. It still smells like cigarettes in here, so it's starting to smell a little bit better, but once we get a fresh coat of paint, it'll look really, really crispy. Backsplash, 20 square feet of this. My guy is about $10 a square foot with material. We're probably looking at about $300 with backsplash on here and over here, but it'll just make this place look a lot better. We're getting stainless steel appliances as well, which we're already in the budget too. We're gonna replace this light over here. We're gonna get a new plastic over it so it looks nicer. And that's pretty much it. New thermostat. I need to remember to order that now that I think about it. We got new light fixture coming in as well. And that's the full tour, guys. Um, relist, like I still plan on relisting 165, 170. So we should still have a, a five, a five digit profit on this if everything goes well. Um, over $10,000 on it with a smooth close, hopefully. This type of condo, I do believe does uh, less than 10% down conventional financing because when you get into the HOA and stuff like that, sometimes uh, they don't allow certain types of financing depending on the insurance and stuff of the HOA. But that's it, guys. Thank you guys so much for watching. I appreciate it. I will see you guys soon. And drop a like, drop a comment, follow me on TikTok, follow me on Instagram. Everything's in the description down below.